Hey everyone, Fierce Technology. What I have here is my iPhone 5S and I'm gonna give you guys a display how the Touch ID works and also how to set it up. So first things first, this is my lock screen right here. Um, so there's two ways you can unlock your phone when you have your Touch ID set up. First one being you can enter your password, your standard password. Second one being is you just hold once your finger's programmed, you can just hold that and immediately it unlocks your phone. A uh, really, really cool feature. Uh, it's super easy to use, super fast, so you don't have to keep on typing in your code, your password. You literally, I'll lock it down, press the button, I literally just hold my finger there, boom, done, and it's unlocked. So um, I will show you, uh, I don't have, say, my pinky finger programmed to do the unlock, so I'll light up my phone right here, and what I'll do is I'll just hold it, and boom, try again and I'll try that again and I'll hold it there, boom, try again. So now you can see my thumb, which is programmed in, I'll hold that there, boom, unlocks. So I don't actually press the button down, I'm just holding that because when I put it into the little standby mode right here, uh, when you're touched down, it recognizes your finger touching down and it immediately starts scanning. So you don't have to press and let it know, you just have to kind of light your phone up. Um, and then just hold your finger right there and boom, it takes you right to the home screen. And it's super simple, just like that. Now I'll go into the settings and I'll show you how to uh, set up that. So if we go to settings, general, and we go down to touch ID and passcode. So it's asking for my passcode right now, which I'll go off and I'll enter it in. So if you don't have a passcode set up already, it's gonna ask you to set a passcode. It's gonna ask you to confirm that passcode once you've set it up as well. Um, now, once you have that passcode set up and you've gone into here, go into Touch ID, and then there's fingers right here. So you can add fingerprints. Um, I'll add, say, my pinky finger this time. So place finger. So I'm just resting my finger, I'm not pressing the button, and every time I put it down there, it recognizes and reads, and it'll vibrate a little bit, just to let me know that it's done reading at that second. So you do have to do this approximately 20 times, and what I would recommend is to move your finger around, move your phone around, so you can see it actually tells me to angle my phone after I've done it about 10 times. Keep on doing that, keep on touching and I'm not again not pressing the button down just touching it's only scanning and there we go complete once I'm done hit continue and now we'll go down we'll lock it down again and I'll wake it up and I'll just hold that down there and boom so now my pinky finger is all ready to scan I'll do that one more time just so you guys can see so I'll wake it up pinky finger, not pressing the button, just touching it right there, and boom, it unlocks it right to my home screen. So that's sort of a demo now on how the Touch ID works and how to set it up. Any questions or comments that you guys have for me, let me know. Uh, one thing to note, um, so far as of right now, you can only enter in five fingers, so you can't do all 10 of your fingers, but for the most part, you're probably going to only enter in maybe three to four, um, because those would be the main fingers that you're gonna be using to unlock your phone. I've only entered my pinky finger in just to show you guys how it works. Uh, but like I said, questions or comments, leave them below. And uh, this is my first video of 2014. I'm gonna be doing a ton of videos this year, I promise guys. 2013, I was lagging down a little bit, but uh, 2014, definitely subscribe to me. I'm gonna have a ton more videos for you guys this year. Thank you guys. Questions, comments, leave them below. I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.